Bernie Bear's Pizza Shop, read by Glow. Today was the day Bernie Bear was going to show his helper, Angelo, how to make a pizza. Angelo, put on an apron and a baker's hat. Boy, oh boy, he said, I'm ready to learn. We'll make the pizza dough first, said Bernie. He told Angelo to mix flour, water, salt, baking powder, and yeast together in a large bowl. Angelo did, but he put in too much water. Oh my, what a sticky mess. Angelo, I'll make the pizza dough, said Bernie. You make the pizza sauce. He told Angelo to fill up the pot with tomatoes then to crush them with a wire whisk. Angelo started to make the sauce. Knock, knock. Someone was at the back door. Barney opened the door. It was Sammy. He had come with the mozzarella cheese. After Barney put the cheese away, he went to see how Angelo was doing with the pizza sauce. He couldn't find him. Angelo, where are you? called Barney. Here I am, answered Angelo. I fell into the pot. Oh my, another sticky mess. That's okay, Angelo, said Barney. I'll make the pizza sauce. Knock, knock. Someone was at the back door again. Angelo, go see who it is, said Barney. It was Rita. She had brought the pepperoni and mushrooms. Boy, oh boy, what a lot of pepperoni and mushrooms, said Angelo as he tried to help Rita carry them in. Ring, ring. Now the telephone was ringing. Angelo ran to answer it. It was Mrs. Jones. She ordered four pizzas to go. Boy, oh boy, four, four pizzas to go, shouted Angelo. We've got to make four pizzas quick. Angelo, help me flatten and stretch the dough, cried Barney. They pounded the dough balls flat. Then Barney twisted and flipped the dough high over his head. Angelo tried it too. Oh my, another sticky mess. Knock, knock. This time, someone was at the front door. Go see who it is, said Barney to Angelo. I hope it's Dominic, the waiter. It is time to open the shop. It wasn't Dominic, it was Mrs. Jones and her children. They had come to pick up the pizzas. Then Mr. and Mrs. Brown came in. They wanted to order one pepperoni pizza and sit at the table near the window. Where was Dominic, the waiter? Ring, ring. Now the telephone was ringing again. It was Dominic. He was sick. Suddenly, Barney had an idea. Angelo, he said, I think you would make a very good waiter. Want to try? Boy, oh boy, said Angelo, taking off his apron and baker's hat. I sure do. Soon, the shop was filled with customers, and the phone was ringing every few minutes. As fast as Barney was making the pizzas, Angelo was serving them. Angelo was doing a fine job as a waiter. And no sticky mess. Barney Bear was happy and Angelo was happy. Angelo, said Barney, I could use another waiter in my shop. Would you like the job? Boy, oh boy, said Angelo. I sure would. And Angelo worked in Barney Bear's pizza shop for a long, long time. The end. You gotta listen to your heart, listen to the beat, listen to the rhythm, rhythm of the street. Open up your eyes, open up your ears, get together and make things better by working together. It's a simple message. And it Follow us. Subscribe! Visit ForTheLordProductions.com Thank you for watching.